Hey everyone, it's Kim from Affordably Crafty and today I have a clearance shop with me at Hobby Lobby. We have Pattern Clearance Bonanza. There's going to be knit, crochet, and some other crafts here too. If you're new here, welcome. My channel is all about teaching you how to stretch your craft dollar and be affordably crafty. Please like, share, and subscribe. Almost also, follow me on Instagram and join my Facebook group where I post about all my deals, steals, and freebies I find in my travels in the crafting world. So here at Hobby Lobby, um, when they first mark down their clearance, unless it's a seasonal clear clearance, like fall, Christmas, those things, it's 75% off right out, of the, right out of the gate. And then if it makes it here in the store for quite a while, say a couple months, two months-ish, it goes down to 90%. And you're going to see a clearance tag right on top of the other clearance tag, so you're going to know that it went to a second markdown. Here, this is the crochet books I'm going through first. There's a lot of, honestly, this whole section, like estimate, ballpark, 90% of this whole section is on clearance, which makes me happy and also kind of, uh-oh. I'm like, ooh, are they going to get new books? Uh-oh, are they getting rid of this section? Yeah. What do you guys think? I'm hoping it's new books and not get rid of. This one was pretty big and in color the whole time, which is cool. There was quite a lot of choices for new crocheters, whether that is learning to crochet or easy projects. So learn to fillet crochet. Hmm. I almost put this one in my car and then I went, when am I going to have the time to tackle that? Put it back. Uh, let's see. And also, when you're here checking the clearance, especially in this book section, look behind. Because it's not always the same book that's in front that is behind it. Some of the sections I found two or three different clearance books in one slot. Also, side note, these are difficult to put back with one hand. Yay. 50 Tunisian stitches. This is the only Tunisian book that I saw here. So they're basically teaching you 50 stitches and four projects. That was a pretty nice one. 101 crochet stitches. And this is from Go Craftsy. I guess it was originally $14.99. I'm sorry, Go Crafty, not Go Craftsy. I picked up that one and then I put it back. Cuffed shawls and more. And honestly, these are not all the same size. Some of these were quite thick, uh, significantly sized books, and some of them were smaller. Ooh, check this one out, when and Winter Chicken Dinner. A Year of Dishcloths. Clearance for $2.49. This is from Annie's. And it teaches you to make 52 designs. Whoa. That's pretty cool. That's an exciting one. Doilies. Woohoo. Not my thing, but go on with your bad self if you love the thread crochet. Although I suppose you could make them in a bigger weight. If you wanted to turn them into, hmm, maybe a rug or a wall hanging. That would be pretty. Cute. Doily is updated. Beginner to intermediate level. That's $249. I always love when these books go on clearance because I usually buy a couple, but I actually only brought one home today. I had a couple in my car and I went, mm, are you really going to use these? I'm trying to be more conscious this year of what I am bringing into my yarn stash. But of course I had to get at least one. I do love my pattern books. I will let you know which one it is when I get to it here on this shop with me. I will also link down below my shop with me playlist. Oh, hello. This is the one I took home. There also is video tutorials online at stitchguide.com. I believe. I thought this was a very good deal for um, sock patterns. You see, I put it on the floor. I picked it up and put it in my car after slouchy beanies. Um, I was saying, I'll link with me down. Uh, 
link with me Get up. link down below my shop with me playlist if you'd like to check out more of this fun craft shopping i have over 200 videos in that playlist now um more messy bun hats okay cool this book was rather large chemo caps and wraps it was it was a pretty big book noggins and necks good name five hat and scarf combos i like that gray one that's pretty basket weave stitch So you see here, it's the new version of it, and then the old version is behind where it's a less colorful cover. Bling, bling there on the bottom right. Cuddle cocoon, so, so cute. Look at how cute that is. Aww. Super cute. Modern baby booties. Oh, I love the purple and gray one on the cover. Green one's pretty, too. I don't think I put a button on it, though. Babies eat everything. Or I should say it all goes in their mouth. Baby hats. <gasps> Look at the bunny! Aww. That's cute. Nice. Super easy baby blankets. These ones would be good for a charity since they're very easy. Right? And. Okay. Easy Afghans. Mm, I kind of like that square with the circle in the middle. What else we got? No. That was where a customer came up and asked me if the sewing stuff was on sale. And I said, sorry, I don't work here. And she goes, I know you don't work here. I just figured you'd know. Ha, ha, ha. Story of my life. Look at how big this book is. There is a lot of patterns in there. Doesn't say how many on the cover, but wow. Best of Mary Maxim. That's pretty cool. Okay, on the top here, ooh, almost bought this just for that pattern. I was like, woohoo, that's pretty. And then I put it back. Now I'm making sure back here they're not different, because sometimes they are. Like that. Sweet baby blankets. Nine cuddly and colorful Afghans. Um, so also while I was tootling around the store, I didn't have a lot of time because I had to go drop off my car for inspection um, and repair. Um, there is a lot, underscore a lot, of fabric that has gone on clearance as of late. So if you are into the fabric arts, you may want to go swing by the Hobby Lobby and check it out. Oh my goodness, Ginger, look at the sheep. The sheep. I know. I was like, ooh, a sheep rug. Um, there also is almost the entire section of quilting thread that's made in Europe is on clearance. I think I put a picture in here at the end. If not, I will put one at the end. There also is a brand new wave of beading clearance. So if you guys make stitch markers, check that out. Reversible Afghans. How difficult is that? Never done that before. Let me know down below. Scrappy Afghans. Uh, what was I saying? Oh. Um, there's a bunch of beading clearance. So if you make stitch markers, you might want to swing by. Or if you just make jewelry in general. Jewelry in general. And the stuff that has been on clearance for a while for the beading is now hit the 90% off clearance. There also was a big markdown on the Learn to Draw books and Fine Art books. Um, 
honestly, the clearance section in my stove was a bit of a hot mess. It was so stuffed to the gills, it's not even funny. Also, all the trim that is next to the um, pillow covers that is right next to the side of this aisle is still all on clearance. 50 ripple stitches. So again, if you're into sewing or whatnot, I did not get this because wah, wah, no crochet charts. Awful. I got all excited and there was no crochet charts. Mix and match blocks with a perfect afghan. Well, that was interesting. I like that ribbed one right there in the middle. I just had to go self. When do you make a blanket full of squares? Never. Ripple afghans, best of Mary Maxim. Love that. Uh, looking behind, looking behind. Ooh, rippling effects. Okay, so going on the crochet books here. Uh, there also is knit uh, books here. And also uh, quilting, kind of cross stitch, felting, baskets for all. I like how it says charts included. Although... Yeah, that's just me. I can just look at the chart and I have to read the pattern. All right, here is the knitting. Learn to knit. I picked this up and then I put it down. Just me. That's what I did. Okay, and then we have beginner friendly knitting. Mm hmm. These are cute. I was tempted to buy one, but then I was like, don't get ahead of yourself. You haven't even started trying to learn to knit yet. So I put it back. I was a good girl. 10, 20, 30 minutes to learn to knit. I was tempted. I put it back. Mm -hmm. None of those little pattern booklets on the side, the smaller ones were on clearance. Just so you guys know. Let's see what else. Oh, there's a D. Those that have done Shop With Me's before know that they write D in permanent marker on the tag when it is discontinued. So you can read the tag and see what's not there anymore. Let's see, cute and cozy knits. Four sweet sets, that is a cute sweater. Mm -hmm. Very cute. Okay, this book is big. Debbie Bliss Baby and Toddler Knits. 20 classic patterns. Oof, that one looks like it's going to take a while. Yeah. Knit Baby Afghans. 34. Ooh, well that's a bit of a... That's a big book too. Oh, also over there, some of the upholstery fabric is also on clearance. These are cute. 17 lovable animals to knit. Those are cute. Aw, seahorse. And a unicorn. This was also a bigger book. Nifty knit dishcloths. Mm-hmm. If you hear the wind in the background, it is so blustery outside today, I half expect Pooh to come swinging by my window on a red balloon. Or Mary Poppins. More than a dozen dishcloths learned 16 new stitches. Cool. What's this little guy? Oh, not a Clarence. Easy stitch patterns. Now this Go Crafty says you can learn free by video on gocrafty.com. Interesting. I also was tempted and I put it back. I was tempted. You see, I put it on the floor in my pile there. Show-stopping knit shawls. Hmm. I'm going to have to look up this company afterwards. Go Crafty. Sorry, that's my chair. I'm writing it down on the list. Go Crafty. 
cozy scarves. And you can see my maybe pile down there. 25 scar shawls and ponchos. Ooh, that yarn is doing a lot of work in that pattern. I believe this is Red Heart. I was right. <laughs> Mindful knitting. They're very nice. Hmm. Then we have Learn to Knit. Learn to stitch knit scarves, six scarves, using worsted weight yarn. That mustard colored one is really pretty. Okay, then we have some interesting craft ones here. The Art of Punch Needle Embroidery. This is a nice craft to get into to use up your yarn stash you already own. Doesn't cost a lot to get into. You need a punch needle tool, some fabric to punch into, and a ring. Uh, embroidery hoop, I should say. I have a kit I need to try out downstairs that I got on clearance this past yarn clearance session. First time felting. Absolute beginner guide. Look at that giraffe. I would not have any illusions that a giraffe I made first time out would look like that, though. Make it modern macrame. Macrame is very on trend right now. As you have noticed that they have been coming out with a lot of new lines of macrame. I will link down below my uh, comparison video of all the macrame yarns and price available at Joann's, if you guys want to check that out. Learn to make rope baskets. Hmm. Interesting. Then here's some cross-stitch stuff. I don't pull all these books out. I just look at the title for you guys. This video is getting a little long in the tooth. I'm sorry. And some of these books are also located in the aisles, uh, whether that is over where the fabric is or in front of where the floss and the crochet and knit tools are. So also go check over there at your local store. Dynamic cross stitch. First time, oh no, sorry, positive quotes in cross stitch. Ooh, I like this one too, teach yourself plastic canvas. Plastic canvas, another way to use up the stash you already own. And all you need to do plastic canvas is dir a plastic canvas in a needle. So there's not a lot of startup costs in picking up that hobby too. These were cute. Honestly, I almost got that one. The classic tissue box. Look at those cute pie slices. Magnets through the years. This makes me think of my grandmother. In a good way. Daisy patterns. And now we're in quilting stuff. So fat quarter friendly quilts, tiny pillows, Christmas patchwork embroidery, <gasps> sewing machine basics for kids. I was also intrigued by that one. First time sewing, a complete beginner's guide. So they're getting rid of all the first time complete beginner's guide ones. Hand embroidery inspired by autumn. Ooh, cute plants. Hmm, also tempting. Tabletop stitches. Retro stitchery. Aw, coffee creates sleep repeat. I love that. Checking behind stitched memories. Cool. Simply stitched embroidery. Sorry, my cats are behind me. My kittens. Iron-on designs, well, I like that. Do I have time for that? Not really. Botanical embroidery, that was cute. Hmm. Organza hoop art. Embroidery stitch guide. Embroidery and cross stitch. Now here's the quilting. First time quilting, one, two, three quilts, homes and gardens. Machine quilting. Which one of these books would you be most excited to get? This book was a huge. Yeah. Regular price on that was $24.95. Biggest book here by a long shot. Quilt as you go. 
paper piecing, time-saving quilts. There also was some of the fat quarter bundles and the jelly rolls also on clearance at the end of this aisle for those that do quilting and whatnot. Gnomes are cute. I like the one with the mushroom hat. Let's get scrappy. Farmhouse, quilting in a day. Mug rugs. Mm -hmm. And I believe this was just marked down a couple days ago. So this is chock full of choices. Here's a zoom out. Which one did you like the best? Here's a few more that were in the aisle. There's rag rugs. 16 easy crochet projects to make with fabric. It's cute. I didn't, I don't think I need a pattern book for that though. Needle felting for beginners. This was a pretty big book. And it has won an award for best craft book by the Craft Business Awards. Craft Business Awards. I'll check that out later. DIY Guide to Tie-Dye Style. The Basics and Way Beyond. This was part of my kittens. Over in front of where the writ dye is. Not where you would think it'd be, which is over in front of the tie-dye stuff, which I thought was odd placement, but whatever. Nothing on that really catching my fancy. And then this one was in front of the crochet tools and accessories. Hey, thanks for joining me here on the shop with me. Please like, share, and subscribe so your friends can learn to be affordably crafty too. And have a creative day, everyone. Happy clearance hunting. Let me know which one you're most excited about and check out my shop with me playlist down below. Bye-bye.